Here's a little update on uh, my ZR7 project. Cleaned it up pretty good. And, uh, so I just put I put these Clubman bars on, and they're really cool looking. But I think they I think they have me sitting too far forward. It just feels it feels scary riding it like that. I had some chrome bar and mirrors, but uh, I didn't like them. They vibrated. So I put the stock ones back on. It's kind of hard to see with these bars on it. And then uh, this windscreen is good. I got it for really cheap. About $15, $20. But it doesn't mount very good. It's already cracking here. I, I might maybe, because uh, it was a really tight fit. I might, um, I might get a heat gun and hopefully it, it'll mold itself. Or, or maybe it'll burn it. I don't know. I got these LED lights. Really, they're really cool. I like them. And uh, got these cool uh, anodized uh, levers. I, I really like the brake levers. They're great. I I generally brake with two or three fingers, so it's really good for me. But uh, the clutch, I think I want a full size clutch. Uh, a couple things I've done. I put uh, brighter LED lights for the gauges, but you can't really tell right now. Cleaned up the bike a little. I got a new seat. I bought it for 30 bucks used. Uh, it was like 50 bucks after shipping, but not bad. I plastic dipped these grab handles here. They look a lot better. They're a little bit scratched up before. I, I chopped the fender. I put a clear LED light. Uh, clear LED tail light and it has integrated blinkers too. So I, it's kind of like I got backup blinkers. It looks fucking looks dope. And I chopped the tail as much as I could as it was left. So I still had the little storage in the back uh, under the seat. And I got a new rotor. I got this Galper Wave rotor. I don't think it's the right size though. It's, it was too small when I put it on, but I was like, hell. Like near impossible finding rotors for this bike. At least a at least a used one. I didn't want to buy for like a hundred something dollars for a brand new one. Take the passenger pegs off. They're gone now. Got new grips. And uh, yeah, but uh, I don't know. It feels like it's too far forward. So I might get some risers and move them back a little, and if I don't like them, the good thing I like is there's a lot of places to put stuff on the bars. Yeah, I've already put this 12 volt outlet, which didn't fit; it was too far. I had to um, I had to extend the wires. It sucks, but I got it to work. And uh, I lubed the throttle cables, everything. I did all that general maintenance stuff. The the oil that came out of it was really nasty looking. I'll probably have to change it in another thousand miles. Hopefully it clears up. Uh, I got this Sigma bike computer. But uh, it actually, uh, it's actually accurate, the, the stock gauges. So I don't know, I don't know what the guy's saying. It, maybe he just didn't ride it a lot. Another thing about this windshield is I had to I have to cut it here, so the um, so it would clear the brake lines. I had to cut it, and then I, I grinded it, so it fits. It's like a perfect fit. <laughs> Look at it. I started cleaning the exhaust a little bit, like I did about half. You can tell which side is cleaner than the other. The left, the left side's the one I started cleaning already. I just cleaned it with the Scotch Brite pad. But uh, yeah, I'm pretty much done with the work on it. I may. I'll put the risers on and I'll see if I like the bars or not. But uh, and then uh, uh, and then if I don't, I heard you can flip them around and they'll be kind of like some dirt bike bars. They're really tall. So I want to try that too. But then that's a lot of work. You gotta take everything off again and put it back on. That's it. It looks nice.
Oh, I also, uh, you probably can't tell, but I cut the snorkel off a little bit so I had access to the battery, just in case. I, I didn't really want to do it, but but it, it gives you easy access to the battery. So if I needed to jump it for some reason, then I could. Like right now, I left the light on, so it still starts. Probably. Let's see if I can see that. So yeah, there I cut the snorkel. So now you can see the battery. It's probably pretty easy to get to. Probably put something on top of it too. And it doesn't really affect the performance. Should help it breathe. Yeah, the filter, the air filter was pretty dirty too. So, so the bike's all tuned up, ready to go. I just, I'll ride with these bars a little bit more. I got an exhaust too. I'll make another video about that. I haven't put it on yet.